Good morning, boss. Good morning. Are we going to Biscuit Head? No, we're not going to Biscuit Head, but it is packed. Oh, man. <laughs> so we are out running a few errands today on this beautiful Sunday. Yes. You won't see it on Sunday, though. No. <laughs> You'll probably Sorry. see it on Monday. We record and then we're a couple days behind. Like, we record and then it takes Carl a couple days to put that video up, so... Today's gonna be a farm video, more likely. Um, we're gonna attempt to start the burn pile, mm -hmm. maybe mow over in the farm area and build the chicken coop some. It's been a while. Yeah. So we're gonna try to get that, not done, but at least some more done on. Yeah, he really does need to try to get it done in the next couple weeks because, um, uh -oh. one, we're gonna get extremely busy, so it needs to get done, and two, our daughter is asking for ducks and, and more chickens. Yeah, and more chickens. So um, even though they'll be in a um, what is it called? A run. A, a brooder. We'll do a brooder first because they'll be babies. Um, but then they have to go into the coop. So the coop. She, she, she's a little chicken entrepreneur. She sells all her eggs. So. Yeah, she does. She has a couple clients that. But somehow I paid for the food, and she that's the best business to have so in the world. So I said to her, well, wait a minute. Are you making money, or are you losing money on this operation? And she said, I'm not losing money. You're losing money on this operation. So at least she knows. That we pay for the chicken food, and she, I need that business. Somebody pays for my equipment. I know. That would be lovely. And we make all the money, right? That would be Oh, what do you have, your bonus? That's all I get. <laughs> right? Yeah. The boss buys me coffee, at least. Yeah. Oh, and some munchkins. So, is it, does it turn into a write-off, though, when I have an employee that I have to buy for? No, you can't write that. <laughs> Don't Sorry. Darn. You can try. Don't worry. So, we're on our way back to the house, and we are going to go out. I'm going to go outside and do The boss is going to go back out. Yeah, I think I have to go run some errands. We need, um, like, chicken food and... Dog food. Pretty much every food you can think of. Yeah, chicken bedding, too. So, um, we're not going to get straw today because it's supposed to be a lot of rain. Yeah, we're supposed to get, surprise, surprise, another one to two inches mm -hmm. of rain. So, but we're going to get stuff done before that, hopefully. And then when it starts to really rain, we're going to go build the chicken. And I'm just working on more quotes in the meantime. Um, don't forget to sign up for your free jobber trial before March 11th yes. so that you guys can be entered to win that um, $4,000 wrap too. I yeah, mean, I'm, I'm liking the program. I actually use it. It's very like the fact that I can just move things on the calendar by dragging. So and here's one thing yeah that we did not mention before. Um, Carl, you guys see that Carl uses his book, his calendar book, and yes, he does have a very strange schedule for some of our clients. We do not do two-week clients. Um, we just think here in the mountains, it's way too long. We, we do a cool season grass, which is fescue, and it grows way too fast in the spring and in the fall for it to go two weeks yes you know not, i mean we're i don't want to in the summer we can sometimes push it to two weeks but what is nice about this program about jobber is that you can go in there and just drag names yeah. i mean if you you can go in there and actually program them to have a schedule of every like 10 days i think it is yeah so the boss is gonna work on that yeah and it will put it in on 10 days i'm not working on it you are <laughs> well so you're gonna work on that today while i'm doing the farm well you're gonna do well i'm gonna do quotes in the program um but where i'm just telling you about scheduling because some of you guys did have questions about scheduling and it is very easy um that you can just drag so you schedule them for 10 days and then say that 10th day falls on your weekly accounts and you have to either pull them back to nine days or push them to 11 days it's super easy yes so today i'm not going to do too much in the aisles we gotta hopefully the boss she's buying me something next week for the farm you guys will see and then we can do more on the aisles 
I'm probably gonna work on pruning back all this so I can maximize the sun that I get over, prune up the crepe myrtle, mow the grass, hopefully before this rain comes. It's supposed to be a lot. Hey, buddy. <laughs> um, we're gonna prune back this crepe myrtle here, prune back this mess all the way back. I think there might be an Asian pear or something in there, but we're gonna cut that all the way back to maximize sunlight up here. I'm gonna prune these broken, rotten branches, cut this one all the way down, and then we're gonna light, well, we're gonna light the fire first. So then we'll see what else, and build some of the chicken coop. So that's a lot. And look at my pile so far of leaves. That's a massive pile. Everything's so wet still that that's all that lit in my fire. So I gotta try to get this going before it starts raining again. As you see, the rain is coming and I'm having a hard time starting a fire. Threw some cardboard in there, threw a little bit of gasoline on it. This is not working. So I'm gonna go over here and mow all these aisles before the rain comes. Then I'm gonna finish blowing all these leaves up. And our compost pile, I'm sure, isn't heated up. We got so busy, it's just crazy. That's what happened last year with the whole farm. So I hope it doesn't happen this year. So let me get out there and uh, mow this so I at least have that done and put the green all along these two bins. So here's what I'm going to do now with the compost because we're getting later in the season. I'll still try that next season once we have the greenhouse up, maybe even this year. But I'm going to put all the grass clippings, pile them in, and then I'm going to blow my massive pile of leaves over top and keep doing it that way. Hopefully this fire gets going before the rain comes. I ended up mowing that with the 36. It stripes. It doesn't have a striping kit on it. But uh, I went over it a bunch of times to get as much of the stuff up. So I have this done at least. I still got to mow this hill here. I'll do that with the 36. It'll do that. So let me see if I can get that done before this rain starts. Hey you guys, we're out here. We, you've seen what we did earlier. I mowed the field. I couldn't get much done. I had the fire going. And then it started raining, and I think we're supposed to get a bunch of rain. So I'm going to put the mower outside in the rain because Paige is demanding I help her build some more chicken coop, right? She's giving me a look. It's been only a couple months, but we've been working it's been on it. It's been nine months. What? It's been nine. Nine months? No. Yeah, yeah huh? What, you got a tracker? Yeah. Okay, yeah, she wants to build a chicken coop. I'm sorry. Look at the evil look. Okay, we'll get it done. Good. So we got a roof on the chicken pen. Good job. How's it look so far? Yeah. A little frustrating because I didn't have all the right stuff to do it. Yeah. Like tools. -wise. I think that we have to go shopping this week, right? Yeah. So I got. And we're gonna have to get wheels so that we can actually move it. Yeah. This is heavy, heavy, heavy <laughs> chicken goop. But it's gonna hold a lot of birds, so. Yeah. Let me switch this around here, guys, because the boss got something, which was. She got a pretty good deal. Yeah. So what do you have there, boss? So we have our first sure can. Where'd you get that? I went into Tractor Supply and actually had to get um, chicken feed and dog food and all that good stuff. And I went in and I was like, you know what? I'm going to get Carl a good gas can because he's always complaining about his gas cans and, you know, all that. So I went back there. This was the only one they had, but guess what? It was missing its cap. 
So I went to get, you know, somebody that worked there and I was like, oh man, it's the only one you have. Do you think you have the cap somewhere? He tried everything. He couldn't find a match. So he was like, well, I'll give it to you for 50% off. So I got a short can for 25 bucks. Cool. <laughs> and then um, he looked up on his phone that Northern Tool, he thought, had the replacement cap. So I was out actually running more errands, stopped at Northern Tool real quick, and sure enough, they did have the replacement cap for like seven bucks. So all in all, um, $32 in for a brand new short can. Yeah, nice. I get to try that out. But yeah. you know what? We're missing a rack for the short can. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> you gotta get me one of them now eventually. Yeah, but... we definitely have to get racks going, guys. <laughs> yeah, we definitely do. Uh, we just didn't have an off season. That was the problem. I mean, do you remember last year we did, you redid the whole trailer. There's yeah. no way you would have had time to do that no. this year. And guess what so. we're doing in two weeks or a week and a half? What? We get to start mowing everybody. Yeah, I think it's it's time. Yes. Um, we're seeing some lawns. That, I mean, hopefully none of ours. We haven't gotten any calls yet. <laughs> we haven't even sent an, our mass email out. No, I, and I mean, I've been talking to a lot of our clients just because they're also fertilizer clients mm -hmm. also. Um, but, you know, you always send that mass email out for mowing clients and you still have those stragglers that, you know, want to wait until April, so. Well, we ain't waiting until that long this year. It's no, too long. I don't think so. We didn't wait that long last year, and I don't think it's, it might go to the end of March with some ones, but we'll not see. all of them, yeah. So. so. So hopefully you guys liked the video today. I have only been in it a little bit here and there. Yeah, and it was a good little farm video. It rained again. But yeah, so whatever. I'll have to watch it. So, <laughs> so. yeah. <laughs> so please like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, guys, be happy. Or at least try. Have a good night. Yes, have a good night.